Get on board with the 2015 Lincoln Funeral Train. Almost 150 years ago, this unique train car was created for President Lincoln to serve as the railroad equivalent to today's Air Force One, but he would never have the chance to ride in it until after his assassination when it was converted to a funeral car. The funeral train carried Lincoln's body, along with his son Willie's, from Washington, D.C. to Springfield, Illinois in 1865, and millions of Americans lined the 1,200 miles of track hoping to catch a glimpse of history rolling by. 2015 will mark the 150th anniversary of Lincoln's death, and one man wants to give people the chance to experience what it would have been like for those mourners who watched the train in 1865, as we remember the man that was pivotal in our country's history. Dave Clokey spent more than 35 years in construction, until he was inspired by a Lincoln documentary to build a replica of an 1860s steam locomotive. Now he builds historic trains in a shop outside Chicago. The Leviathan 63 is a fully operational steam locomotive that Clokey and his team built from the ground up. And it's the engine that will pull the Lincoln funeral car in 2015. The Lincoln funeral car is a very unique car. It's the only one ever made like that. And uh, it's mostly for historic reasons I want to put it together. And or we want to do the, the Lincoln funeral train in, in uh, 2015 with this engine several cars. We're going to have to make most of the parts for the Lincoln funeral car because there's none available. We already have some made. <clears throat> I made the axles last winter and we already have the axle pedestals cast. They're here and uh, we have the plans done and actually the plans are in the fabrication shop to get a quote on the material to build the structure itself. The process of building the Lincoln funeral train involves hours of labor of course, but beyond that it involves the coordination of obtaining parts from manufacturers, many of which are not typically made by any modern-day companies. Dave is working with experts who are helping with the interior design of the car and is paying attention to every detail on the outside of the car, ensuring that he can create a replica that is as close to the original as possible. In addition to the funeral car, an officer's car will also be built to replicate the funeral train procession that brought Lincoln home to Springfield. And once everything is finished, plans are in the works to recreate as much of the trip as possible. Though modern day railroad traffic and missing lengths of track make it impossible to run the exact same route. Obviously, to make all this happen, Dave and his team need funding. Beyond the parts and labor necessary to build the train cars, the logistics and costs to move the train across the country will require a great deal of funding. We are asking you to get on board with us for 2015. Help build the Lincoln Funeral Train by donating a tax-deductible gift to the Historic Railroad Equipment Association and become a part of history. Learn more at the2015lincolnfuneraltrain.com.